In this video, I will go over the top 5 cars from AMG that I think are still bargains even in 2022. In one of my previous videos, I looked at the AMGs that have recently shot up in value. Now I'm going to look at the other end of the scale, at the cars that present good value for money. This is quite a varied list, so there is something for everyone here. Number 5. C43 AMG Introduced in 1997, the C43 came to North America in 1998. Powered by a 302 horsepower M113 V8 engine, it can sprint to 60 miles an hour in about 6 seconds. This is one of the last Mercedes to have the classic rectangle lights and squared off bodywork. Inside, the seats in these cars are also particularly nice. The C43 is relatively rare as only 3,085 sedans were made and 772 wagons were made. If you are looking for a classic AMG and want to keep the price and running costs down, the C43 is a good option. These are super reliable cars and really the main thing to look out for would be rust if the car has lived in a harsher winter climate. Just around 10,000 US dollars is all you need to get one of these with higher mileage. The collector grade example C43s with super low mileage trade above $20,000. Number 4. SLR McLaren While this is not an AMG badge Mercedes, it's certainly one of the ultimate AMG powered Mercedes, so I'll sneak it onto this list. Its supercharged M155 V8 put out well over 600 horsepower, and its carbon fiber structure was very innovative. At 300 to 400,000 US dollars, the standard SLR may not seem like a bargain. However, when you compare it to its contemporaries such as the Porsche Carrera GT and Ferrari Enzo, which today sell for millions and millions of dollars, the SLR suddenly looks like quite a good value. It certainly has a similar level of prestige as its rivals, even if it is not as desirable as the other two today. The SLR was not as focused as the GT or the Enzo, and it wasn't as rare, with 2,157 SLRs produced. Of course, these are quite reliable for an exotic car, but parts such as brakes are very expensive. The earlier models of 2005 and 2006 have been very steady in their value over the years. Number 3. CLS 55 AMG Powered by the M113 K V8 with nearly 500 horsepower and wrapped in a sleek body, the 2006 CLS 55 has a lot going for it. It may not be as iconic as the E55, but the CLS 55 has a few benefits over its E-Class counterpart. For example, the CLS comes with good sounding mufflers from the factory, unlike the quiet mufflers of the E55. And the available performance package on the CLS is good to have. Just like the E55, the CLS is reasonable to own and maintain, as the engine and transmission are strong, and things like the air suspension are not super expensive to maintain, with good third-party support. Recent sales show that these CLSs sell for bargain prices. 14,000 to 16,000 US dollars for cars with relatively low mileage like 50,000 to 60,000 miles is an awesome deal. Even with the performance package, which includes better wheels, brakes, and differential, the price still stays reasonable. They made 6,586 CLS55s, so they're not super common to see. The fact that this was a one-year car for North America is pretty cool, so the CLS55 is definitely a bargain. Number 2. C63 W204 The C63 arrived to North America in 2008, and it was one of the smallest models to receive the M156 V8 engine. The C63 is one of the best-sounding factory AMG models, and it likely won't be beaten anytime soon. Furthermore, the C63 is definitely one of the most fun-to-drive AMG models. For a brand that used to be considered all about power and not handling, the C63 was a huge leap for AMG. The 2010 Plus examples with the P31 package 
have SLS engine internals, which push an already good engine to that next level. They sold a lot of these, over 40,000 C63s were made, and thus they are not super expensive on the used market. 30,000 US dollars can get you a really good example, while the best late models sell for around $50,000. Reliability is pretty good, but the M156 engine does like to be taken care of as I've covered in some of my previous videos. My opinion is to get a C63 and enjoy it while you still can. It's an amazing car. Number 1. SL55 R230 If you are looking to get the most AMG for your money, the SL55 is the way to go. They sold these from 2003 to 2008 in North America. Like the CLS on this list, it's powered by the M113K V8 with 493 horsepower in the SL and later 510 for 2007. Not only is the SL a great looking roadster, the folding hardtop made it hugely desirable in the early 2000s. And the design has stood the test of time. These SL55s are still very inexpensive in today's market, and this is because of two main factors. One, they've made a lot of these, over 20,000 units produced. And two, many of them still have low mileage. So there is a decent supply of these cars available. $25,000 is all you need for a great example. And the best low mileage examples trade up to $50,000. The running costs are also a little higher than some other Mercedes, as the ABC suspension or hydraulic top may require some service down the line, but nothing too outrageous with this car. And that's it for the look at the top 5 bargain AMGs in today's market. Let me know in the comments what you think about my list or any other cars you would include in this list. Thanks for watching, and if you want to support the channel, take a look at my store, link is in the description. If you want to see more AMG content, subscribe for more videos like this one.